Is riding a school bus a privilege? Tonight, that's what a mid-state school system says after a bus driver shortage today left parents scrambling at the last minute to find a way to get their kids home from school. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb joins us from one of the schools impacted with that today out in Wilson County. Jason, the school system says there's no end in sight for this problem. And Wilson County School says it's doing everything it can to hire more school bus drivers, even reaching out to retirement communities for help. But they say so far it's not enough. And today that left parents here at West Wilson Middle School and four other schools in Wilson County scrambling. We have reached a critical mass on this problem. School officials minced no words today describing the school bus driver shortage in Wilson County. It's so frustrating, but we have four routes that are either partially down or all the way down right now, um, and we really don't have any end in sight. No end in sight, school officials say, for a bus driver shortage that today shut down one bus route in each of five different schools. Today, some parents got robocalls telling them with just a few hours notice, their kids would need to find another way home from school. You're looking to, you know, work your eight to five, and now you're getting a call letting you know that you need to be at school by two o'clock to pick your kids up. So uh, it, it really changes your day. Bottom line, Wilson County Schools says they don't need to provide their students transportation to or from school. A lot of people assume that transportation is mandatory. It's really not. It's a privilege in Tennessee. And unfortunately, we're just not able to meet the demand. Wilson County Schools says it suggests parents having a backup plan for their kids if their bus route is suddenly canceled. If you're not satisfied or you feel like it's too crowded or you're frustrated, I think that we would encourage them to seek out some alternative solutions at this point. To insinuate that all parents have flexible schedules or, or can arrange other means of transportation is uh, ignorant, for lack of a better word. I don't want to give people false hope and pretend that we're going to have it solved next week. Leaving some parents wondering just how their kids will get to school next week or next month, or even just tomorrow. Yeah, nobody knows. I mean, uh, at this point, who's, who's to say? Wilson County School says they've been dealing with a school bus shortage since all the way back in last November. They say they tried to give them a $2 an hour raise, but the county commission voted it down. Reporting live in Wilson County tonight, Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.